right, we're going to uh, teach you how to play a basic rock beat using quarter notes. Quarter notes are counted one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. We'll play on the ride symbol, the biggest symbol on your set. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's quarter notes. You want to use your wrist and fingers. A nice loose grip. Not too loose where you might drop your drumstick, but enough to use your wrist. You don't want to squeeze the stick and immobilize your wrist. Drumming is all wrist and finger. Good. The bass drum, you want to keep your toes down on the pedal. Heel up. About a half an inch to two inches on the back. Pretend like you glued your toes to the top of the pedal. And pretend you're stomping on a bug up and down with the leg. Good. Now, when you're playing, you could go ahead and anchor your weight into that bass drum because we're using a single note for right now. So you go ahead and kind of just lean into that drum. Okay. Now, your one, two, three, four ride cymbal will have a bass drum, your foot, on one and three only. Your snare drum with your left hand is going to be on two and four of that quarter note. So foot and hand for one. One. Hands for two. Two. Foot and hand for three. Three. Hands for four. Four. Put it together. One. Two. Three. Four. One. Two. Three. Four. Good. Now we're going to play on the hi-hat. The hi-hat symbol is over to your left. And if you take your foot off the pedal, you'll see that the symbols open up. There's like a gap. And if you push down on the pedal, it closes. You want the hi-hat to sound like a chick, chick, chick when you hit it with the closed. Just like that. If you didn't put enough pressure on it and it was open, it would sound like this. It's annoying. We don't want that. So we want chick, chick, chick. One, two, three, four, your quarter notes. Right hand crosses over left. I always make my students say that. So say right hand crosses over left. So if you're playing like this, somebody yell at you. Right hand over left. Okay. You want enough pressure to hold down those hi-hat cymbals. Toes down, heel up, just like on the bass drum. So now your right foot and your left foot are both toes down, heel up, okay? Now you're gonna feel kind of discombobulated, like you're gonna fall off your chair because you're on your toes, kind of like a ballerina. Give it a week or two and you'll thank me. It'll go away. So, you can do the same beat. Foot and hand, one and three, hands for two. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Foot and hand, hands, foot and hand, hands. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Excellent. Now, to play uh, two measures and then add a crash symbol, which are these guys, I would say count to four twice. You'll hit this on the one, because whenever you add a crash symbol, it's part of your beat. You can't just randomly hit those things. Uh, you got to know where you're at. So in this case, we'll hit it on count one, and then we'll switch over to the ride for two times of counting four, two measures. Crash symbol, back to the hi-hat, back and forth every two. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four symbol. One to the ride. Two, three. Oh, that was one time. One, two, three, four. 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 One
two, three, four, symbol. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, switch. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. A little bit faster. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, switch. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, switch. Three, four. One, two, three, switch. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Just work on that. Quarter notes. Four, four. Basic rock beat. Good job.